Barrett. So Barrett gives it to uh, Test. He's got Isles. He's got Isles. He won't need him. Zach Test has got a double, and that brings up 100 tries in his magnificent sevens career for the United States. Well deserved. I thought he had an opportunity to get it wide to the speedster, Carl and Isles, but he backed himself. He's already made one try through with great footwork, but it's all about power on that occasion. The right hand fan right in the face. They might be able to win it at the dead here, Australia. Green running into her own teammate, throws a loose ball. Taki, the 17 year old, the clear head at the moment. Politi, this is who you want it in the hands of. Avania Politi trying to get to ground, but Ember's ripped it away. Cheddar Ember's ripped it out of the hands of Politi, and she's surging off. She's got 50, 20. Australia, USA to win it at the dead Cheddar Ember. Incredible finish to an incredible match. So well deserved, too, to Cheddar Ember. She's been part of everything, all the action in this match. Restart, retention, ball carries, just all of the groundwork. And that's that's awesome rugby right there. That's a solid strip, completely legal, but it's almost deja vu from Glendale. The quarterfinals where USA just strips it from Australia. United States, they've got a nice wide attack here. <laughs> Kelcher, fires one off the ground. Decent pass as far as Doyle. There's Lauren Doyle, she's got plenty of guards. Needs a bit of support on the inside. Oh, she does not! She shrugs off the tackle and says, see you next time. I walk underneath the sticks to touchdown for try number two. Well, brilliant play from Lauren Doyle. Spanish defending, not at its best though. The experience from Doyle, the second all-time appearances behind Kelly Griffin for the United States. I thought she ran out of space here because the switch wasn't on, but then the defender let her yeah. alone. She gets a second Eight. try, and the Eagles fans here are going wild. The tackle has to be made by Kukina. The United States, Kelter trying to go through the gap. Kelter with the handoff, and then a lovely change of direction. Steps off the left foot, and of Kelter stretches the leg inside the 22, and all the way she goes. What a try. What a try. She's a sensational athlete who has absolute pace and strength. One of the standout players for the USA in their three victories yesterday. Gets it back from the line-out. And a little drop on to the boot for Yosefo to chase. He does well, and Madison Hughes is there with the follow-up. Brilliant run from the USA captain, and they hit straight back. Well, we don't see a lot of kicking in the game, but that is once again a very special little kick. Look at this for a little grab it through on the left foot from Kala, and you are all popped up. Presence of mind just to pop it up there from Martin Yosefo. He's really hitting the mark now from South Africa, forcing the USA to go wide. There's the strike queen. It's Naya Tapa. Naya Tapa puts her foot to the floor. You executed what you needed to do and get it out to your strike on the left. Accurate passes when they needed to be. And Pina out there marking Naya Tapa had no chance because she just doesn't have the out and out pace. Tapa didn't even need to use that fend in the face because she was already well on the outside. And great tactics too from Richie Walker giving this lady a rest and bringing her back on. Mark for the U.S. as 
Doyle with Kelter. Doyle tucks it away, so Kelter's not going to get it all. Now she'll get it. And there goes Kelter and Chiafani. Chiafani just across halfway. Back it comes to Doyle. Off to a tapper. Tabelman there. Looking outside and stepping through. And look at the move Scottish team. If you ever them off, somebody did. From Kenya when they're up 26 0 and they came back to win that match. They're very much still in this game. Uh, Scotland, but possession is for the Americans. They want to get it to Oz. Here we go. Individual tries on the circuit, and the 